Hey, hello again, boys and girls. Welcome back to the class. Hello again. Before start with today's class, let's do a review about vocabulary too. Yes? Here we go. All right, so first of all, let's do a review of vocabulary too. Yes? So, pay attention. What is that? Yes, money. Next picture. Look at the picture and tell me. Yes, very good. Put away. Next. Look. Yes. A price. Next. What is he doing? Yes, he's buying. So, buy. And the last one. Look at the picture. What are they doing? Yes, very good. The word is compare. Excellent. So, now we're going to use these words from vocabulary 2 to complete some sentences. So, you're going to use the same words. Money, a price, put away, compare, buy. So, you're going to use these words to complete some sentences. So, let's do it together. The first one. Please, your video games after you play. So, which is the correct word? Please, your video games after you play. Yes, very good. Put away. Next. If there's to pay, we pay it together. When something is too expensive, you can share the cost. So, yes, very good. A price. If there's a, a price to pay, we pay it together. Excellent. Next. Look. Prices and choose what you want. You have to choose between two things. So, you have to yes compare look compare prices and choose what you want excellent next you can products like toys or books on the web you can no it's not money buy yes you can buy products like toys or books on the web remember that you can buy things on the internet yes and the last one this is a question. Who has more, you or your brother? Oh, this is easy, right? Money. Yes, excellent. Who has more money, you or your brother? Okay, so now let's go with the student's book. Yes? Please write this in your notebook. Just this part in your notebook, please. Open your student's book on page 86. Student's book, page 86. So first, we're going to listen to the grammar and then we're going to complete the questions in exercise 7. So, please listen carefully. Okay, here we go. Grammar. Are there any cookies? Yes, there are a few. Is there any orange juice? Yes, there is a little. Excellent. So, I'm going to read it again. The first one says, Are there any cookies? And the answer, yes, there are a few. So, we use a few to talk about quantities related to countable nouns. Yes? Next. Is there any orange juice? The answer, yes, there is a little. So, the same, we use a little to talk about quantities, but for uncountable nouns. Yes? So now, let's complete exercise 7 that says, read and write. So, I'm going to read the questions and we're going to complete the answers with a few or a little. Number 1 says, is there any ice cream? So we have yes there. Ice cream is an uncountable. So we use yes, very good. 
a little. So, is there any ice cream? Yes, there is a little. Number two. Are there any grapes? So, grapes is a countable noun. So, yes, a few. Are there any grapes? Yes, there are a few. Number three. Is there any milk? Milk is an uncountable noun. So, what we use for uncountables? Yes, a little. So, is there any milk? Yes, there is a little. Number four. Are there any potatoes? Potatoes is a countable. So, are a few. Very good. So, are there any potatoes? Yes, there are a few. Very good. So, please write the answers in your book. And now, I'm going to give you more examples with a little and a few. Let's go there. First of all, here you have some definitions about a little and a few. A little is an adverb. It's used to talk about quantities, to show that you are talking about small quantity or amount of something. Singular nouns. A few. Adverb is used to talk about quantities. Use a few to show that you are talking about a small number of people or things. Plural nouns. So, I hope this help you more with the exercises. Yes? So, let's go there. Choose between a little or a few. So, I'm going to give you some sentences and we're going to complete it together. So, here you have the sentences. The first one says, My sister has talent in volleyball. Talent is an uncountable noun. You can touch the talent. So, a little or a few. Yes, a little. Very good. Number two, they have questions, plural noun, questions. So they have, yes, a few questions. Very good. Next, I can only put hot sauce on my foot. Hot sauce, uncountable noun. So, no, it's not a few. Yes, the correct one is a little. I can only put a little hot sauce on my foot. Next, there are people waiting in the line. People. You can count people, so there are a few. Very good. There are a few people waiting in the line. Next, David needs patience. So, what do you think? Yes, a little. Very good. Excellent. Next sentence. Sandra has colorful bags. So, Sandra has a little or a few. Yes, a few colorful bags. Here we are talking about the bags. So, she has a few. Very good. Next, we work together for weeks so we work together for yes very good a few weeks excellent you're doing well next sentence mary has time to spend with us the time is an uncountable so mary has no it's not a few yes the correct one is a little very good Mary has a little time to spend with us. Excellent, guys. Next, there are students in my class. We can count students. So, yes, excellent. A few. Very good. Next, and the last one. All you need is self-confidence. So, yes, very good, guys. A little. All you need is a little self-confidence. Very good. Excellent. I like it. So, please, you're going to copy these sentences 
in your notebook. Yes, copy the sentences in your notebook. And let's go back to the student's book. Yes, page 86. So here we go again on page 86. Exercise 8 that says, play a game, cut out the game board and the cards on page 111. Put the cards on the board, play with a partner. So, you're going to play a game that is like, guess who? Van a jugar un juego parecido al adivina quien, but related to foot. So, you're going to page 111, which is this. Is this part 111 and you're going to cut out the board and the cards yes and you're going to play with a partner you can play with your mom with your dad with your brother or even your grandparents and look at the example in the book for example the boy in in orange and yellow shirt says is there any soda and the other boy says, no, there isn't any soda. And then he asks, are there any eggs? And the other boy says, yes, there are a few. Here you are. Okay, so please try to do it and have a little fun at home. Okay, now let's watch a video. glasses of juice. There are a few glasses of juice on the table. That's a lot of juice. Uh, now there's a little juice. One, two, three bowls of rice. There are a few bowls of rice on the table. That's a lot of rice. Oh, oh, now there's a little rice. One, two, three, four. There are a few jars of olives on the table. Did you like it? Yes, it's fun, right? So if you see in the video, it's giving us more examples with some, with a few and a little. All right, so now you will continue with teacher Laurita and then you will check your homework with teacher Eden. Yes, very good. Goodbye.